Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. What time is it right now? It is around 7 o'clock. 3. No. It is around 3 o'clock. It's about 3 o'clock. Um, we just went for a really long walk to the park, and then we played at the park, and then we walked home. So, I'm so tired and sweaty. And I honestly forgot that I had to vlog today, or else I would have been vlogging when we were walking and stuff, but I was freaking dying anyway. Um, so, I'm just about to shower. We're working tonight, Avi. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna shower, wash my hair because I was sweating. I just made the baby some chicken nuggets so he's eating and then hopefully he'll wanna take a nap so that I can take a nap. So that I can make it through work. Because like I said in my last vlog, I'm not drinking Red Bull anymore. So staying awake all night is really hard for me. <laughs> Maybe I'll have a coffee actually. Maybe I'll have a coffee before I go. Hmm. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys probably after I shower. <laughs> Don't film me. I missed it. Do it. I can't do it, baby. CJ just got some spatulas in the mail. <laughs> Look. The cut. Wow. Cool. I said do hibachi. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Can I have one of those for my monomer? For my nails? No, it might, it might bleed through it. Well, you really look like that you know what you're doing. I look horrendous. It's 6.34, so I should technically be getting ready for work right now, but that's fine. I'll go in a little late. CJ made dinner. He made smash burgers. Say hey, hi. Let's go in. Oh, he doesn't want his. So yeah, um, we took a nap. I'm actually just waiting for my my grocery delivery. I ordered groceries from Whole Foods, so I'll probably put a grocery haul in this video. Um, if you're not interested, you can obviously skip it, but it's supposed to be coming in between six and eight, so we'll see when it gets here. But I'm just gonna eat this and then start getting ready, probably. Okay, guys, I just started doing my makeup, so I only have my eyebrows done and only one of them carved out it's 7 30 so i'm definitely gonna get to work a little bit later tonight um but we just got groceries so i gotta put this shit away honey nut morning oats applesauce for the baby we've got one onion because i still have some i just needed like one more bananas the only thing i hate about getting stuff delivered like this is they put everything in plastic which i normally would not do and um you know you can't use reusable bags which sucks so yeah Got some of these uh, vegan cheddar squares for the baby instead of goldfish. I got me some Sriracha Sunshine Hippies instead of eating an unhealthy snack. These are really good. Some seaweed snacks. I love seaweed snacks. I got a little bag of barley, peas, and lentils because I'm going to be making veggie soup this week. And I actually have this veggie soup on my YouTube channel. If you guys go back a little a little bit, like back in my videos, it's called like my favorite veggie soup or something. And it's so good. So I'm gonna make that this week. And we got some vegan blueberry muffins. I told you guys we're not vegan anymore, but I still try to, I mean, I, I go back and forth, you know what I mean? Like sometimes I'll shop all vegan, sometimes I'll shop like everything's regular, dairy, whatever. Um, but I'm definitely trying to get better again and go more plant-based. So most of this stuff is plant-based, if not all of it. And since I'm trying to get pregnant, I really 
want to give up dairy um, because that's just not good for it's not good for pregnancy it's not good for humans it's not good for pregnancy it's not good for a newborn it's just not good period so you know I'm eating it because I'm selfish but I'm trying to give it up um, you know so yeah okay um and this is like such like hypocritical but this isn't for me this is for the baby just some like annie's easy max mostly for when he like goes to my mom's house or my mother-in-law's house or something and i could just throw that in his bag so that they have something easy and quick to make for him so i'm not making them prepare him a whole freaking you know meal um i got this dairy free mac and cheese it's rich and creamy cashew sauce i've never seen this before and i love trying the different like plant-based mac and cheeses this is another one vegan rich and creamy annie's mac and cheese got some penne pasta because i'm going to make penne al vodka. then i got some rigatoni just to have in the pantry because you always have to have an extra box of pasta in the pantry because it makes for a very easy dinner. Even if you do just garlic and oil, it's an easy dinner if you feel like you don't have anything else to make. So the cold stuff comes in these bags. And here is just some eggs. Very rarely eat eggs. Um, Literally once in a blue moon, we'll have like scrambled eggs for breakfast. I'll make them for August or we'll make French toast or um, I was buying those Just Crack and Egg cups. You guys have probably seen if you watch my past grocery hauls, but I'm not really trying to eat those anymore because they have cheese and meat in them. So yeah, but I just got eggs because we just used the last one making French toast. So just to have them in the fridge. This is my favorite vegan pizza ever, vegan harvest flatbread. It's really, really good. If you guys are looking to try a vegan pizza. We got some French fries, just shoestring French fries. And I got some Beyond Beef, ground beef, because like I said, I just wanna eat more plant-based. I got some mushrooms. I love mushrooms. Soy milk, which is what I always get. I got some of these. Excuse me, I'm filming in here. I got some of these hickory smoke turkey slices. I like these for sandwiches. And then to go on the sandwich, I also got these smoked Gouda plant-based slices, which are very good. They're the Whole Foods brand. I got some of these Stony Field dairy free smoothies. I got three of them for the baby for breakfast or snack. I got some of this Mayoko's classic chive cheese. This is so good on toast, on crackers, on crackers. Toast, on crackers. It's really delicious. I love it. And I haven't had it for a while. I got a block of tofu. I know not a lot of people like tofu. I personally love tofu. If you're looking for some recipes to try it out, I will put my recipe Instagram in the description so that you could go there and look at some recipes. This is celery for my veggie soup. I already have carrots um, in the fridge. So we did not need any of those. And this is the last bag. Got some butterhead lettuce. And uh, this was a substitution. I wanted blueberries. That's the baby's favorite, but they gave me blackberries instead. So that's fine. Hopefully he'll like them. And this was also a substitution, which I was so, I'm so mad because I wanted kale. I like to put kale in my smoothies. Um, and I like to saute it and eat it for breakfast, but they gave me spinach instead. Not the same, not the same. 
So yeah, that kind of sucks, but we'll get through the week. <laughs> and then I just got some green seedless grapes. I think this might've been a substitution too, because I'm pretty sure I got red seedless grapes, but okay. So yeah, that's everything. I'm gonna put all this stuff away, continue doing my makeup, and I'll show you guys my makeup when I'm done. Hey guys, so I just finished doing my makeup. This is what it looks like. Um, I think that maybe I should like blot my lips or something because I don't like how this pink color looks on me. But um, I'm gonna show you the foundation I used because I just got it and I really like how it's looking so far. I mean, if there's any way to test a foundation, being a stripper is like the best way because you wear it for a long time, you're dancing, you're sweating. <laughs> so this is the foundation, it's NYX Born to Glow. I have very dry skin, so if you have oily skin, I don't know if this would work for you because it's like a dewy foundation, but so far, I really like the way that it looks. Um, so yeah, that is the foundation I'm using. And my eyeshadow, I'm only wearing one eyeshadow and it is a sugar pill eyeshadow. My lips is a Nick, Nick, Nick is a NYX Suede, this one. NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick in the color Tea and Cookies. And then I just have like clear gloss on top of it. Not the biggest fan of this color on me. So like I said, I think I need to like blot it a little bit and make it like less pink. But yeah, um, I'm just gonna put in my hair extensions when I get to work because I just don't feel like, I don't feel like doing it right now. But I know once I get to work, I'll kind of like, what's the word? Like get more energy, you know, just like from being in there and I'll do my hair there. <laughs> so I brought my like flat iron and everything and I'll just bring my hair extensions and put them in there. And I already packed my bag, my shoes are in my car. Um, I'll show you guys what I'm wearing when we get there, of course, but I'm gonna wear a dress. I brought three different dresses just because I kind of want my stomach covered. I feel a little bit bloated, so I don't feel like wearing a two-piece tonight, which is what I normally wear, but I just feel like wearing a dress. And I don't even know if I told you, but it's Sunday. It's Sunday, so who knows what's gonna happen. We'll see what we could do. Um, I'm getting tattooed tomorrow, so I'm kind of just hoping to make enough money to pay for my tattoo. I mean, I know I'll probably make more than that, but that's like, you know, in my head, like it'd be nice to just made this money for my tattoo so that I don't have to touch any of my other money, you know? So, um, yeah, I'll see you guys there. Hey guys, uh, so I'm on my way to work right now. Obviously the angle is um, wrong, but you know, whatever, my phone's up on the thing. Dude, I'm so tired right now. It's, um, what time is it? It's 8.45, so we'll probably get to work around like 9.30 which is definitely a late start for me. When I left, the baby was crying. He did not want me to leave, which never happens. So that made me really sad because he never cries when I leave. Like normally when I'm leaving and I'm saying bye, he like blows me kisses. He's like, bye, bye. You know, like he doesn't care. He doesn't really care at all. Like he says, right, you know, whatever, bye, bye. But for whatever reason, he was just crying and he didn't want me to leave. So it made me feel really bad. And um, I really am not in the mood to go to work. I'm not even gonna lie, but I need to go because it's not looking good for my club. I really think that um, we are gonna get shut down again. So, and like I've been saying over and over, manifestation, I wanna be pregnant soon. So I really just need to go to work on the days that like I say I'm gonna work, you know, and not just, not go just because I don't feel like it, you know? <laughs> I'm pretty sure everyone wishes they could just not go to work when they don't feel like it. So I need to stop doing that and just push myself and go to work and make money because I don't know how much longer I'm gonna be able to work, whether I'm gonna have a baby bump or we're gonna get closed down um, or both. So yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know. I don't know, I like telling you what's going on, how I'm feeling, and that is what's happening. So, uh, like I said, we'll probably get there around 9.30 because I pretty much just left my house. 
um, and I have to do my hair and everything. So we're definitely gonna get on the floor a little bit later than what I like, but we'll see what happens and I'll see you guys there. Hey guys, so I just counted my money because um, honestly I did not think that it was a lot at all. But I ended up making $534, which is honestly good because there was no one in the club last night. Like, it was so dead. Probably one of the most dead nights that um, I've had there since, like, you know, we reopened and stuff. It was dead, dead, dead. Like, just freaking empty all night and I left at 2.30 um I was thinking I made like maybe $300 but pleasantly surprised that I made $534 because I really did not think that I made that much at all um so that's cool because I'm getting tattooed today so that will more than cover my tattoo <laughs> he's telling me shh so yeah there's really nothing to tell about last night i mean like i said it was so freaking boring i have my friend from like when i used to dance she was there like as a customer so it was really nice to see her i haven't seen her in like five years and she threw me a lot of money which was super nice of her and then um i was with the same guy all night he was okay, he was a little bit stingy, but when I was on stage, he threw a couple of hundred, so that's pretty much where all that money came from. And um, yeah, it was just boring, I was just not into it. But you know, it was so crazy, like you guys know that I keep talking about how I hope to be uh, pregnant soon. Uh, when I walked in, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> when I walked in, there were, there were, when I walked in, I showed you guys there were pregnancy pop drops on the counter. And I was like, someone's pregnant here? Like, what? But I just felt like that was like such a sign of like, you know, like from the universe. <laughs> so yeah guys that is it um sunday night it was freaking dead freaking boring but i still managed to make 500 dollars which is terrific and um I tipped out thirty dollars, so I actually ended up making like five sixty. But we only count what we take home, right? So tip out is, you know, excluded. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.